What is the normal HCG level for twins at two weeks? Hello everyone. Today we're going to dive into the fascinating world of human chorionic gonadotropin, or HCG, particularly in the context of twin pregnancies. This hormone is extremely important, as it's often the earliest indicator of pregnancy. What is HCG? First, let's talk about what HCG is. It's a hormone that is produced by the placenta after implantation. The levels of HCG increase rapidly in early pregnancy, and it's the hormone that pregnancy tests detect to determine if a woman is pregnant or not. Normal HCG levels Now, on to the HCG levels. Typically, in a singleton pregnancy, the HCG levels at 2 weeks post-ovulation or 14 days past ovulation, DPO, which roughly corresponds to the day of your expected period, are between 5 to 50 mu per milliliter. HCG levels in twin pregnancies In twin pregnancies, HCG levels can be more variable. Due to the higher amount of placental tissue with twins, HCG levels can be higher than in singleton pregnancies. However, they can also fall within the normal range for a singleton pregnancy. So, while an HCG level that's particularly high might suggest a twin pregnancy, it's not a definitive indicator. The only sure way to know if you're carrying twins is through ultrasound. To answer your question more directly, at two weeks past ovulation, the HCG level for a twin pregnancy can be anywhere between about 5 mu per milliliter and significantly above 50 mu per milliliter. It's a broad range, and every woman's body is different, which can lead to significant variations in HCG levels. In conclusion, while higher HCG levels may be an indicator of a twin pregnancy, it is not a surefire sign. The only definitive way to confirm a twin pregnancy is through an ultrasound. We hope this video has helped you understand the fascinating world of HCG levels in pregnancy a little better. Thanks for watching.